Good evening, everyone, and a very warm welcome to this delayed and very different senior prize giving. Normally, there would be literally hundreds of us in this assembly hall for the celebration of talent and endeavour of our wonderful pupils, with proud parents, relatives, staff, and of course, our prize winners. COVID has required us to think differently about how we do things, or even if we do them at all. But it has led to some very creative ways of being together virtually and of celebrating our sense of community. Recognising the efforts of our fantastic young people who give of their best each and every day, COVID or not. I have spoken before about the importance of resilience. There is now clear research evidence that this shows the importance of interdependence of young people with their families, communities and schools as the key to resilience. More than ever just now, we need our young people to develop bounce back ability and the ability to stick with their goals through tough times. They need grit to flourish in the face of challenge and energy and excitement to want to try. This is why finding ways of celebrating together despite COVID is so very important. Since March, our school strapline, Aspire, Attain and Achieve, has never been more vivid for our staff, pupils and parents, as they have shown grit and determination to keep learning flourishing in the face of such difficult times and this global pandemic. The courageous efforts of everyone during lockdown was inspiring. How quickly we went from school closure to home learning was nothing short of epic. So well done and thank you to our families and staff who have supported and encouraged our prize winners to be successful, enthusiastic and motivated about their learning, even when for such a long period of time this was done in the kitchen, in bedrooms and sometimes outside in the sun. We continued to set high expectations and to have high aspirations for each and every pupil and is this that supports our ambitious drive to aspire, attain and achieve. To our award winners tonight, we are celebrating your aspirations, your attainment and achievement, and saying to each and every one of you, well done and congratulations. You have shown commitment, effort, and great resilience. That resilience will stand you in good stead in the future when you face perhaps even bigger challenges. You continue to be role models for other pupils. You have the power to shape the spirit, ethos, and expectations of other young people in this school. Your commitment, your drive and determination, and as I've said before, resilience, sets the tone, raises the bar, and becomes the inspiration for all to follow. Tonight, we have marvellous individual achievements from all our award winners, but particularly from our two star performers, Louis Ainsley, our Ducks, and Abby Coburn, our Proxima Kesset. Louis and Abby, you are an absolute credit to your families and to your school. Your names will be etched on our Ducks boards and remain there for generations to come. To our parents and carers, you have provided our prize winners with support, encouragement, love and opportunities each and every day of the week. I hope that you will take the opportunity this evening to give yourselves a big well done. I am extremely privileged and proud to be head teacher of this fabulous school community and I am blessed to have a wonderful and hardworking staff and I would like to thank them for their support, commitment and loyalty to our school. So, well done and congratulations to all of our senior award winners of 2020 and I know that you will go on to do great things in the future. Well done, everybody.
that let me in Shattered windows and the sound of drums People couldn't believe what I'd become Revolutionaries wait For my head on a silver plate Just a puppet on a lonely string Or who would ever want to be king I hear Jerusalem bells ringing Roman cavalry choirs are singing Be my mirror, my sword and shield My missionary That was when I